Improve your life with black seed oil. Black seeds, sometimes called black cumin, are produced by the fruit of an ancient plant called N. sativa. Medicinal use of these plants dates back thousands of years. They're even referenced in religious books of Islam and Christianity. Today, black seed oil extracted from the seeds continues to be touted as a treatment for a variety of wide-ranging health conditions such as acne, arthritis, diabetes, and others. But these claims should be taken with caution. Scientific studies don't support many of these supposed benefits, and certain people should avoid black seed oil entirely. Let's take a closer look with preventive medicine specialist. Potential black seed oil benefits don't assume that black seed oil can be a cure-all for certain conditions, says Dr. Sapper. There's no robust, rigorous evidence supporting using black seed oil for any specific condition, he says. However, there are small studies that raise the possibility of black seed oil being helpful in a number of conditions. Further research is needed. DR. Sapper stresses that black seed oil should never be used in place of conventional medicine for a given condition. At best, he says, it may serve as an adjunct to conventional therapy. In other words, as a companion to medications, here's where black seed oil may be beneficial. Managing acne and other skin issues creams, gels and lotions with black seed oil could help you reduce acne and zap pesky pimples that always seem to pop up at the worst possible times. Research suggests that black seed oil has antibacterial and anti-inflammatory properties that may help tame acne, notes Dr. Sapper. One study showed that a gel with black seed oil reduced acne severity by 78% when used twice a day for 60 days. Studies also have indicated that black seed oil could have some potential when it comes to addressing skin issues related to vitiligo, or loss of pigmentation, eczema, wound healing, psoriasis, reducing seasonal allergy symptoms and estimated 400 million people around the world know the sniffling and sneezing that comes with allergic rhinitis, more commonly known as hay fever. It's the toll of breathing in pollen, mold, animal dander, and other allergens. Black seed oil might offer some hope for relief, says Dr. Sapper. In fact, topical use of black seed oil reduced allergy symptoms in 92% of people with hay fever in one small study published in 2014. Taking black seed oil capsules also have brought positive results. Easing arthritis black seed oil's potential ability to reduce inflammation might come in handy if you're dealing with joint pain from rheumatoid arthritis, RA. Researchers concluded that black seed oil may be beneficial as an added therapy for people living with RA, says Dr. Sapper. But their conclusion followed a very small-scale study with 42 people with arthritis. The anti-inflammatory effects are connected to a compound in black seed oil called thymoquinone. However, a review of existing studies notes more research is needed to explore thymoquinone's effectiveness as a medical treatment doctor. Sapper stresses that given the severe joint destruction rheumatoid arthritis can cause, conventional therapy should always be the mainstay of treatment. Fighting cancer investigators called black seed oil a safe and promising anti-cancer agent after review of published research, while noting the need for more study. The 2011 report examined studies that looked at the medicinal herb's potential effectiveness against a dozen types of cancer doctor. Sapper notes that several successful anti-cancer medications have their roots in nature. Paclitaxel, often sold under the brand name Taxol, is derived from the Pacific yew tree, for example. 
However, the 2011 report should in no way steer people toward only using natural compound treatments when facing a diagnosis of cancer. Who shouldn't take black seed oil herbal medicines like black seed oil may sound tame and naturally good for you, but that doesn't mean they're always safe to take. Black seed oil can pose risks to certain people, the doctor. Sapa recommends against taking black seed oil if you are taking blood thinners of any type, as black seed oil also works as an anticoagulant and may increase bleeding and bruising. Pregnant. Having an upcoming surgery, given how black seed oil can act as a blood thinner and reduce blood platelets, which can lead to postoperative thrombocytopenia. Improving breathing in keeping with the anti-inflammation theme. Black seed oil also has shown promise as a complementary treatment for asthma. A 2019 study showed that a small group of people who took 500 mg of black seed oil twice a day for four weeks improved their asthma control test ACT scores. The ACT assesses shortness of breath and other effects of asthma. Chronic Obstructive Pulmonary Disease COPD. Researchers found that a small group of patients who took a 1-gram capsule of 100% pure cold-pressed black seed oil twice a day for three months experienced better pulmonary function. Given the serious nature of asthma and how untreated asthma can lead to hospitalization and even death, Dr. Sapper emphasizes that conventional controller medications, such as inhaled corticosteroids or Montelicast, should serve as the cornerstone of treatment for the condition. Managing diabetes black seed oil has long been used to lower blood sugar levels and treat diabetes in various parts of the world, including Morocco and Jordan. Scientific research suggests the approach may have some merit. Review of studies published in 2019 suggests that black seed oil could be used alongside traditional medicines to control diabetes. Again though, researchers noted the need for more study of its anti-diabetic effects. Dr. Sapper adds that in serious conditions like diabetes where we have excellent scientific data on the effectiveness of dietary change, exercise, and a variety of prescription medications, these must be first-line treatments. Other potential risks of using black seed oil there have also been case reports of black seed oil use leading to rashes and allergic reactions in some people after consuming black seed oil or applying it topically. Kidney failure after someone with diabetes took black seed oil. Irregular menstrual bleeding, irregular periods. Gastrointestinal discomfort and nausea. Remember this too. Government oversight of dietary supplements isn't as stringent as prescription or over-the-counter medications. That makes it difficult to know exactly what you're getting in quality and concentration. Herbal medicines have pharmacologic properties like drugs, clarifies Dr. Sapper. But they're different because their side effects happen for many reasons. So if you're considering taking black seed oil as a supplement, it's important you talk to a doctor first. The side effects of these supplements aren't well documented and can look different for everybody. Final thoughts although there's existing research about black seed oil, more studies and rigorous clinical trials are needed to figure out how, or even if, the supplement should be used to help treat various health concerns, as there a reason for some cautious optimism. Sure, but Dr. Sapper stresses that black seed oil isn't a substitute for prescribed medication, and many health claims are disproportionately positive given the state of current research. Thank you for watching.